What's up everybody, this is Sean, and I'm going to be doing a review on the Atmos FX Creepy Clowns Digital Decoration. This decoration is so awesome. It is perfect for your haunted house, your yard display, your Halloween parties. This can be used for multiple different things. Um, you're going to be very pleased with the creep factor. So the creep factor of this digital decoration is turned up to 100 because it is so like creepy. Like the people that are afraid of clowns are <laughs> really going to be afraid of clowns after they see this in your display or in your haunted attraction. So I would definitely recommend adding this somewhere in your display um, or your haunted attraction if you can. Um, as you can see to next to me is the big top tent. This is just one of the examples that in my vision I would see using the creepy clown digital decoration. Um, you can use this in any kind of setting you would like. Um, there is multiple modes as you'll see in the teaser trailer that I'm getting ready to play. But I decided to set this up as if the clowns were invading the big top. Um, you could build a facade just like the one in this video um, and you can help open up the doorway, put in your uh, illusion film and, your, and project onto it or just project onto any kind of film that you may have. Um, you can even put a TV around it if you have a big enough screen. But without further ado guys, let's get into the teaser first. And then I'll pause that and kind of walk you through the different specifications and stuff for the creepy clowns. So let's get started, guys. Pretty awesome stuff guys. You're getting a lot of different scenes and ways to display this digital decoration in your attraction or your yard hunt or your party, whatever it may be. So the creepy clowns do come with three different clowns. Each come with about five to six different scenes that you can choose from. Uh, the resolution is 1080p HD and it comes in a mp4 format the orientation modes are horizontal and vertical so that gives you the it gives you kind of the the leeway to either do this in the doorway or a window or project this on a wall whatever you would like to do um, and then the there is of course the window and the doorway versions 
which have the big top background or no background at all. So you, it's up to you whatever you want to put in the background. Um, if you're like doing this with your Hallusion projection screen, um, you can put whatever background you would like. So next I'm going to kind of, we're going to go back into the main review and I'm going to show you all just a few little teaser scenes that are included with each clown. I'm not going to show you a lot. I'm just going to give you kind of like a little teaser. Um, if you want more information, you can always go to the um, web address that is linked below in this video um, to learn more about the creepy clowns and what are the different scenes and stuff that are with each clown. So let's get into that. And if you would, just look into the tent that is next to me and you will, the show will begin shortly, guys. Alright, so that is just quick little teaser kind of videos of some of the scenes that are included 
with the creepy clowns digital decoration. You've seen some jump scare scenes, some startles, um, some scenes where they are just kind of messing around and doing and clowning around, uh, you would say. <laughs> There's a lot of different scenes that are going to go great with whatever kind of atmosphere you're wanting to go for um, and level of creep factor you're wanting to go for. If you want to keep it kind of not so this one's not so kid friendly um but it is sort of there's some scenes that you can use that aren't as scary for the younger crowd and then of course you've got your startle scares that you're you're going to be able to add to your haunt, haunted attractions and haunted parties that the adults are going to go to so this Digital decoration is beyond amazing. I love the details. The clown characters are so awesome. They fit perfectly with the the what you would expect out of a creepy clown. Um, you, you're you're almost like able to like kind of combine yourself with this scene as well. Um, it's gonna fit just great within your haunted attraction, I think. Um, your, your actors are going to be able to kind of interact with almost with this digital decoration too as well. So it would be perfect for that clown scene for sure. So hope you guys enjoyed this creepy clown digital decoration review from Atmos FX. Like I said, if you would like more information or to purchase this digital decoration, just go to the link that is in the yellow box underneath the ticket booth here. And it will take you to the website where you can learn more about Creepy Clowns. You can purchase individual decorations, etc. So until next time, guys, keep it spooky. And it's almost Halloween, folks. So let's get those decorating plans going. And I would love to hear what you've got going on. So let me know down in the comments below what you had planned for this year. And let me know what you think about this digital decoration as well. I'd love to hear that. So, till next time, guys, we'll see you later. Bye.